Hey, good morning, Math 7 students. This con is called Construct Scale Drawing. It's kind of fun. It's kind of a hands-on activity. Um, so I actually enjoy this one. So here's what we're doing. Um, Cole on this one is an urban planner. He wants to create a small scale drawing of a city block. Note that the block is a square width with a side length of 90. Okay, so we want it to go 90 meters by 90 meters by 90 meters by 90 meters. Here's what we notice. We have to draw a city block knowing that one unit, so just one of these little units, this little unit right here, um, represents 30 meters. Okay, so if you think about it, here's 30 meters, 30 more, 30 more going this direction, and then 30 more, 30 more going that direction. So it's got to look like that, if that makes sense. So you need to take each of these dots and manipulate them until it looks like this, where it's 1, 2, 3 across by 3 down, which, by the way, 3 times 30 would be 90 by 90. Hopefully that makes sense. Let's try one more just to make sure, though. Okay, so on this one, Elizabeth made a scale drawing of her school's basketball court um, to devise a winning strategy for the team. The dimensions of the court are 15 meters by 27 meters, okay? Move the points on the grid below. Notice that this length right here, if you go from right here, one, two, three units represents nine meters. So that length represents nine meters. Well then, what does each little one unit represent? Well, since there's three of them, nine divided by three, one little square represents three meters. So, since we want one that is 15 by 27, and we know that each little unit represents 3, we need something that is, let's see, 15 divided by 3 is, is 15 divided by 3, 5, and then 27 divided by 3. What is 27 divided by 3? What is 27 divided by 3? Oh yeah, 9. So we need one that is a 5 by 9 drawing, which would look like that right there. 5 by 9. So that's what it's got to look like, guys. Hopefully that helps you. Um, if you have troubles, uh, see me at Google Hangouts. Bye-bye.